I, I just wanted to state, sir, that really, I don't know, I I give up. <laughs> I give up. I've, I've been a, a staunch, I, I, I don't know, I was the one who believed it basically that the, the country basically is sold out. <laughs> Hi, Mike, but, you know, despair is really not an option. If you're saying to me uh, that our friends on Wall Street whose greed and recklessness and illegal behavior plunge this country into the recession that we're in not right now and who want to go back to the way they used to be and give themselves huge bonuses and so forth and so on and you're telling me that the heads of the insurance companies and the drug companies have enormous power and are fighting for their own interests and their own profits at the expense of everybody else you're after like, that is the reality but despair is not an excuse you can't say you give up we can't give up i've got four kids and six grandchildren, beautiful kids, all of them. I can't give up. You can't give up. What we have to do, which is tough stuff, is figure out how did we get to where we are right now. Was it a wonderful idea, as Alan Greenspan told us, as President Bush told us, and as some Democrats told us, that we want to deregulate everything. Let Wall Street do whatever they want. Uh, is that a good idea? Is it a great idea that the Supreme Court recently said corporations are people? And they can contribute as much money as they want to the political process. Is that a good idea? It's a, it's a horrendous idea. The reality is clear. We don't talk about it terribly much in Congress or on TV. A small number of people who have incredible wealth and power control a lot of what goes on in America. That's the simple reality. Now, you can throw your hands up and say, it's too much. I can't deal with it. Or you can say, this is tough stuff. This is tough stuff. And how do we once again bring ordinary people into the political process how do you create a government that works for the middle class rather than the wealthy it ain't easy but giving up is not an option